Hi and welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to tell you how to work with the content in Joomla. If you use, if you create a new article, and how you can change your content color, or how you can add a link. Well, like you can see, I'm now in the article manager content. That's that's just. I'm going to go to show you once again content article manager add new article. So this is uh, the editor of Joomla, and like you can see, you can write here anything you like. Hi, my name is Linda, and I'm now showing you. How to add thing just just for fun. And let's see if I got this just for testing thing here. I click save. I got one text here. Uh, what you can do is if you want to make it bold, you, you use this one. If you want to make it italic, just this one. If you want to use it uh, underlined, you can underline it. <coughs> uh, well, I, I'm going to show you one thing. I have the funniest thing here. Funniest. There we got the Phoenix one. I will just just copy it. I'm going to the test one. What is it doing? Test for just a test. This is a just test one. I'm going to copy the table here and then I'm going to select everything here and here we got a font family I could create a, now it's a, actually Arial Black but if I don't like Arial Black I could, for example, uh, let's see. I'm going to show you font family, Ariel. I could also go, go for impact. Or, for example, I could go to the uh, Look at Tika. I could make it bold. I like that. Or I'm just Ariel Black again. I could go to the uh, 12 points. Or the uh, 14 points. So you have to show on the uh, front page if it, if it will be work on the website. So that's why I chose the 12 points or the 10 point. And if you like another color, you could um, easily change the color by going to text color. And that's how you change the color. This is how you change the table. So this is the text color. You can also make it a blue. So this is how you change the table. 
Now, if I want to create a li normal link, I, I can just add a text here. Hi, this is my text. And then I select the text. I click on insert a link. I write an URL, website headers, my headers, that's gum. This is your, your title. I want to click on target. I could click new window. I click OK. And that's how you make a, a link. That's how easy it is. And if you want to upload an image, you can do it here. <coughs> and you look for an image, well, you go to choose file. And then you are going to look for, for example, which is my images here Is daar in 28. En dan klik ik start upload. En dan. En dan if you go for the image, insert edit image, you can go to. Add a pay, um, sensory, that's gum, and then um, image dot gpg. Image. And then, okay. Well, that didn't work, so now I'm going to go back to the images here. Look what the name was of the image. Image. Okay. I did something wrong, so I'm going back to the into the image. Let's go. Image. So. Thumbs and zero. Thumbs and zero. Emits. Okay, still not showing up, so image choose well.
so. I'm not making sense. And now I'm going to look what the name of the image is here. Keep Okay. Okay. Let's just do it again. Keep it here. And now it's showing up. Like you can see, you have here the uh, align left button, align right button. Uh, and uh, justify and if you just add text here you want to just add some text here and then we're going to add it align left and then the text should go Okay, a line left or a line right. That's all. We should play a little bit with the text. Normally, you have more text, so then. Uh, it would look better. I could just show you with a normal item. Let's see. Terry. Me Terry. Okay. I'm going to make a copy here. could use this picture. I'm going to show it on the right here. And I right. Or I'm going to show it on the left. I could also insert a video with this button. With a source in it and or an event code here. I could look at the source code and I could change things in the source code which can be handy if things don't work via the editor or with writing. I could just add some breaks in the page for example which make it go have some more spaces in it or enter and it's easier than just just uh, with the with the editor because if you just click enter enter enter, there must be too much space. And if you use the source code and add uh, the error in it, it will have lo lo it will have less space in between the lines here. So this is the enter button, full screen button. And well, basically, in, in, in any of these articles, you can add a meta description, a meta keywords. You can add them here if you like that. So, there are many options in the
content. You can also show title, links, options, publish date. You can also change all those things. So I hope you like this tutorial. And I hope you will be back soon to my channel to watch more of my tutorials.